okay the machine is back up maximize the window login now we need to create the zone go to the DNS manager and create the new zone on this machine right click on the reverse lookup zones create new zone click next go here and select the primary zone and to all DNS servers in this domain that is fine click next yes IPv4 not IPv6 next should be 192 168 1 that's our zone select whatever the default value allow only secure dynamic updates that is fine click next and finish now let us go to the forward lookup zone and we need to create the host that the two host missions to host entries for the two nodes this will be node 1 okay the IP address for the node 1 is 1 192.168.1.111 okay select the PTR record similarly add node 2 okay we are done creating the two nodes here okay so if you go and take a look at this it added the PTRs here okay now we need to go and create the cluster admin we we can make this as a cluster admin or we can create a new user and use that user on all the machines to cluster the computers I'll go here active directory create a new user cluster admin okay create the user here is the user that I created cluster admin I will use the cluster admin to log in on node 1 node 2 now we need to okay we need to add this user into cluster administrator okay let's go to the locations sorry the domain admins we need to add this to the domain admins okay we made the user CLU ADM as a domain administrator okay now, now we need to 
join the node 1 and node 2 to the domain so let us go to the node 1 first add that computer to the domain so right click on my the, the computer click properties here click change settings instead of work group select the domain it will be data manager okay so I need to use cluster admin account to add this computer to the domain okay the reason is we need to set the IP address static IP address that we didn't do so we need to go to the network click network and sharing center click manage network connections here this is a public IP and this is private IP network so right click on the public IP adapter click properties for the TCP IP set the static IP for this node 1 192.168.1.111 the default gateway which will be the router IP address and DNS server will be cluster DC uh, IP address which is 192.168.110 okay if we set this IP and now if we add the mission it will add okay I think we need to give dot local okay now this mission is added to the domain we need to restart this mission so do the same thing for the node 2 go to the node 2 first let's create the IP address okay okay this is our private IP address uh, we will set the private IP address and we are setting the private address address for the node 2 for the node 2 the private address that we have assigned is 2.12 for the node 1 it will be 2.11 so let us go here maximize this window Two dot twelve for the node 2 
okay we have given the IP address static IP address for this node 2 now we need to add this node 2 to the domain so right click on computer properties change settings our domain is uh, meta manager dot local okay now the node 2 has been joined let's go ahead and uh, restart the node 2 let us go and see the node 1 if it okay the node 1 is up Okay, we will go and uh, ping the node one from cluster DC mission. Okay, the node the node one is up and running. How about uh, okay? It is pinging the local host. Now let's go and ping the node 2. Okay, the node, node 2 is up and running now. Okay, so the cluster DC can ping node 1 and node 2. We'll do the same thing from node 1. Let us go and ping the servers here. Okay, it can ping 110 that is fine oh sorry we need to ping um, one one two which is node two okay we can ping node two from node one okay we need to we need to give the private ip we forgot to do that in the last step let us go and assign the private IP address. I think 192.168.2.11 for node 1. Right click properties. Double click on IPv4. okay so now we have assigned the IP address for the private IP, private network so that uh, node 1 and node 2 can talk if we if you for, forget to add the network adapters still you can go here click settings you can go and add the network adapter but you already added so that is fine now we need to go and ping from node 2 to other machines on the domain Okay, this mission can ping the domain. This is node 1. Okay, this is working fine. We need to create the shared disk. Uh, we can create the shared disk on uh, any computer in the domain. So, I will create the shared disk on the cluster DC mission, the domain controller on this mission I will create the shared disk okay for that I need to have the Starwind software on this mission installed 
I need to create the SKC targets on this machine.